TV. Well, right now, the biggest party in the state is underway in a town with less than 2,000 residents. Rag Riot's making its second overnight stop of the ride in Pocahontas, about 140 miles just north of the metro. KCCI's Todd Magel is there, a little jealous, Todd. There are a lot of people celebrating in this tiny town. Ray, we are on Main Street here in Pocahontas. It is a big night. Look at here. We got wrestling going on here. There's a giant concert on a stage behind me near the courthouse here on Main Street. You know, I've covered Rag Rai for 40 years. I have to remind myself, this is not a bike ride. This is a giant party, and you just ride your bike to get to the party. The Pocahontas Street Party started early and lasted all day and most of the night. Ragbri riders put down their bikes and laced up their dancing shoes. The people in Iowa are so uh, giving and just so generous, you know. Kevin Holland is a 12-year Ragbri veteran from Oklahoma. He's used to riding in unbearable July heat, but today it barely got above 70. I mean, come on, you don't, we couldn't have written down on paper what we wanted in weather and got it a better uh, weather forecast than this. It's a sea of bikes in town. That's not a surprise. But seeing a crew without bikes is a surprise. I like to skate. This is one of my favorite things in the world. So I just find places where I can skate. Arnoff Shaw is from New York City. He and his team rollerblade on Ragbri. They think we're like crazy. I think everyone here is kind of crazy in a good way. I didn't realize how famous I would be just because I'm, I have more wheels than everybody else. It's a real kind of test of your heart, you know? Can you persist? Um, and then you've got all the beautiful stops along the way. Number two. Now the town of roughly 2,000 people has exploded to more than 18,000 thanks to so many riders. And that's just fine with the owner of the Zone Restaurant. She says the classic summertime Iowa tourist attraction is a dream come true. All my workers here, you know, it takes a village to really make this go. A little overwhelming, but it's great. It's wonderful. We welcome Rag right to town and super excited to have them. And we're told the party will wrap up here soon. Everybody has to get up early. Next stop is Emmitsburg. Rhea? Todd, I won't ask uh, how much you've partake, partaken in the partying, but I do want to know, it looks like it is a way or uh, some of the route is uphill. Yeah, you know, it's 56 miles to Emmitsburg. The elevation changes 1,700 feet from here to there, but that really doesn't compare to the big night. That's Wednesday, a 105-mile ride, and that's from Emmitsburg to Mason City, so that's going to be a tough one. It sounds Rick. like it. Well, pace yourself there, Todd. Thank you.